MLB Network is your exclusive home for postseason baseball. It's the second game of this ALCS between the Kansas City Royals and the New York Yankees. Again, everybody, Matt Vaskersian welcoming you to our exclusive postseason coverage on MLB Network. I'm joined by Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and Danny. An important ball game coming up here in game two. Yeah, it was a good start for these guys at home. They did what they needed to do in the opening game, and this crowd really showed up and made a difference as well. Should be an electric atmosphere again. So we'll see if the guys on the field can feed off it and take a commanding lead in this series. The postseason is officially in full swing. Lineups and first pitch coming up next. Pitch of the at bat on its way. Liner toward right center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Hey, this game's starting off exactly the way they want it to. Lead off single. Uh, not fooled there as this ball's hammered out to deep right field. Almost into the short porch, but it's off the wall. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. That yeah, good. some guys have the ability to rise the occasion, while right. some guys shrink away when it matters yeah. the most. Well, this guy is a gamer. He's been on fire since the postseason started, and after that hit, it looks like he doesn't plan on stopping anytime soon. First pitch coming. Here it is. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He pulls into second safely as they take the lead with two runs scoring on the play. The left fielder. We didn't have to wait. Swing and a drive. Uh, to get that one, you'll need a 50-foot ladder to make the catch. A no-doubt home run. A long two-run homer off the bat of Giancarlo Stanton. His second home run of the series. As the Yankees start to pull away a bit, it's now four to nothing. You know, as a pitcher, there's nothing worse than getting taken deep, but it's something every pitcher has to deal with. Even the best pitchers give up home runs. You just have to the payoff pitch one more time. Swung on and belted to left by Perez. This one's deep. Into the second deck and gone. A solo shot here to left. His first homer so far in the series. As they get on the board, it's 4-1 to one now. Well, if you're going to give up a towering blast to one of the best players in their lineup, it's better to do it with no one on base. It stings, sure, but a solo shot isn't going to be the deciding factor in a game. The 3 0. He loses him on ball four. Interested to see how he approaches this next AB. Now a drive by Judge. Deep left field. But it bangs off the wall in front of the short porch. The relay. Uh, the throw pulls him off the bag. Man, they already hit one home run, and I thought they had a second one right there. Not quite enough behind it, though, as it banged off the wall for a double. He's giving up a fair amount of solid contact right now. Giancarlo Stanton now. He sends it out to left field. Well hit. Oh, my! It's gone! Santa Maria! A 
three run home run for Giancarlo Stanton his second home run of the game as it's now a six run ball game. See I just don't understand that he had an open base and could have pitched around him but they challenged him and lost big time. That is one costly decision. Now here comes Kansas City manager Ned Yost making that slow walk to the mound. And I mean just off the corner. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger and there are two away. That's a pretty unique pitch sequence guys. Usually pitching is all about mixing pitches and location. But he threw that all out the window to get that strike out. He offered the same pitch three times in a row. So I guess he sort of used that reverse psychology. To out the Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two seamer and that's out number one. You know what was really impressive to me about that strikeout? He fell behind 2 0 to start the at bat. That's a pretty bad place to be, but then he kind of refocused himself and came right back with three quality pitches in a row to sit him down. That's not easy to do, but now. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Certainly not showing any signs of intimidation with these middle of the order guys. That's back to back K's, and the three and four guys are harmless. Into the windup, here comes the 0 2 pitch. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that is out number three. Three up, three down, three strikeouts. Not too shabby. More baseball on MLB Network right after this. In now, Giancarlo Stanton. He'll lead things off as we begin the home fifth. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Well, and he gets the inning started with a bang as this is hit high and deep to left field. But it's off the wall right in front of the short porch. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Looked like he broke into his home now run trot it. a little That's early, and, and I can't Gary. blame him. He's already had two, That's but this good. one just misses, and he'll settle for a double. Having a heck of a game, though. Put him away. So now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. Hits it high and deep out to center field. Favre ranging back. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Now battle. Good stop. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Notch one in the score column as a runner from third crosses the plate. It's an eight to one ball game. Heck of a job by the batter right there. Now here's a fly ball well hit Favreau racing back to the track. Oh my it's gone. Santa Maria. Greg Bird connects for a two run home run his first homer here in the series as they've pushed this lead up to nine now. Guys, we've seen four big balls between the two teams so far today. What are your impressions of the long ball display we're watching? Ground ball sent back up the middle. And a glove flip for one. On to first, it's a double play. As their woes continue, the inning is over. Your basic 6-4-3 will get him out of danger. Don't touch that remote. More on MLB Network. Nobody out. Now this is on the ground to first. We'll see if they can get two to second for one. On to first, and that's the very last thing they needed at this point in the ball game, as there are quickly two away now. That's one of the hardest double plays to turn right there because of the difficult throw the first baseman has to make. No problem this time, though, and they get the two outs they were looking for. Well, 
looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Hit high and deep out there to left center field. Frazier going back at the track. On the warning track, he makes the catch. The Had to go a long way to make that running catch, and here it is again with the show track data. Took a great angle at it, showed nice closing speed, and ended up running close to 120 feet to bring it in. No doubt that grab saved extra bases. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. KC down in order. They're down nine. It's ten to one. Your Dylan Vitenses comes on now from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Yelling. That's a Kansas City. Good night. On paper, this had the makings of a real hard-fought game, but uh, paper and reality, those are two different things. They pulled away and never looked back. How about to a tune of a nine-run victory? One more look at the final line score there to see the great pitching performance that led his guys to the victory. And there's no better time of year to come up big for your team than in the postseason. And that's exactly what this man did. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, no time like the postseason to come through and lift your team to victory. He was certainly a big factor here, and it was pretty cool to see. to one the final lopsided score in this ball game New York take a 2 0 lead here in the league championship series Sonny Gray gets the W on the mound Todd Wells allowed seven earned runs to cross the plate in the losing effort so that just about does it for Mark DeRosa Dan Plezak Heidi Watney down on the field and the rest of our crew I'm Matt Vaskersian thanks for watching MLB Network